Hi everybody, Dutch Waifu here. We're going to do something other Warhammer related. Now in December 2016, I last played Deathwing, the Space Hulk series. And since then a lot has changed, or at least so I've read. Uh, there's supposed to be uh, an entire new class, a lot of new weapons, new tweaks, uh, some uh, visual uh, enhancements, some colors. So I was thinking of maybe that we should just, you know, revisit Deathwing since we let it gather dust so long. And the angels are pretty awesome. I just finished the book about the lion, so I have that angel feeling again. So let's uh, let's have a look see. We're just going to start a quick campaign. I uh, will play it first single player. Maybe later on I can find uh, I can rally some people for some multiplayer. But let's just see how how much I will survive this first. Simulator for main activated functions. There, for some reason it popped. Into Destroy the targets with your storm bolter. So the tutorial seems the same. Now what I like about first person shooters is the detail. Look at this epic door. I'm gonna zoom on my right. Stand here, be pretty. Good. It seems something has changed. If you look at the crosshair, you can see the middle. Now, I'm not sure if that's an auto aiming system or something, but who knows? Wait, but to zoom. Go to the next test room. Oh, aren't you for the bundle of sunshine? That's how it is. Eliminate the targets with your force sword. Excellent. Your combat systems are operational. change it to E and go with the use to some entirely different button because use is something that's probably most in static situations. Heal order move. Let's see, is F is follow order. G is also already used. Z X. Oh, Z and X still seem open. 
just going to put use on Z. Because nobody cares about that anyway. At least it's not like, oh, I have to do something. And then put the parry. Where's my parry? Parry. Parry the platypus. Parry, 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 parry. I thought we just had here. Ah, I'm looking way over it. There. Apply. Eliminate your targets by charging. Wait, was that it? I just... There ain't no mode! Choo choo, motherfucker! Bam! We have detected a small problem with one of the compensators, but you may continue the tests. Destroy the targets by using your lightning strike psychic power. No anomaly detected. Continue testing in the next room. Your arm has been injured by the explosion, as you can see on your status monitor to the right. Open a psychic portal with the side gate. Hello. Oh, it is a loading time. Oh, my. Your zone. Use the mobile armory to equip yourself with weapons and psychic powers, as well as to check that the armory machine spirit recognizes you. Well, that's quite nice. Because I did the key binding change, it changed the, the, the text box as well. If I look at this 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 user interface, the font is so not 40k. It's just so not 40k. I mean, look at this. Look at this font here at the wall. That's 40k. That's the high uh, gothic type. Use the portal to return to the combat zone. No, 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 I have to, I have to get fixed. Let's see. This is entirely new for me, this menu. I have a... Secondary weapon, power fist, war sword, of course the mace.
these pretty guns. Okay, I'm getting distracted by my like, issues, as always. Let's go back. Enter. Speak friend. Oh wait, wrong universe. Excellent. The systems are perfectly calibrated. Now, let's test your hacking system. Approach each door, then perform the requested action for each one. There is some interference, but we are working on it. Go to the next room. Destroy the walls by hitting them in melee to find an important relic. System operational. Continue. No, I have to smash. I want to smash. Smash. Okay. Four smash. Continue. What? Destroy this element and activate the command. Open. Nothing to report. Carry on. Test your long-ranged hacking system on the turret, using your tactical interface and hacking. Honestly, am I the only one who was annoyed by this entire interface? Look at that font! It's not good! Heresy. Uh, use terminal. Terminal? Long-range hacking system, right. More interference. Reconfiguring. Go to the last step. It's me. What? Fuck. Oh. Is shooting at me.
finished up there. Eliminate all the hostiles as quickly as possible. Apothecaries can use their Narthesium to heal their allies. Order your brother to heal you. Aim at the door and order your brother to hack it. Anomaly found. Yay! Oh, I don't care about times. Difficulty disciple? Nah, normal. Come on, we're not that bad. Then just put in a. Uh, put in a. Uh, uh, this is Grand Master Belial, addressing all warriors of the First Company. Forged from countless ships in the seething forces of warp space, a space hulk has been deposited here by the uncaring tides of the Immaterium. I have dubbed this drifting lair of abominations Olethros. A hive swarm of Tyranids already besets the system. So while the honored warriors of the Death Wing embark upon the purging of this space hulk, our brothers shall assist the Astra Militarum and Imperial Navy in destroying this tendril of the Great Devourer. Yeah. Command of the assault belongs to an epistolary of the Librarian, a deadly battle psyker of the chapter. Leading a specially assembled squad, the Librarian will investigate abnormal augur returns and psychic emanations from within the space hall. This is neat. Premonitions. The ether gifts me visions. I see a threat far more deadly than gene hungry tyrants. A scream and a dark promise. A ship in the shadow, a relic from our secret past. I feel the tightness in my gut as I see a cataclysm as yet unseen. The Opera Mortalis descends upon us. The shadow of death. Brothers, the first scans of the Space Hulk have revealed a Dark Angel ship that dates back to the Age of Heresy. It is located in the heart of the Olethros Space Hulk. This ship from our ancestors seems to be protected by a mysterious energy field. Teleportation to the ship is currently impossible. The only way to reach it is through the main mass of the Space Hulk. Reaching this ship is your primary concern. Trust your battle brothers to deal with the rest of the Olethros. Brothers, retribution is at hand. It is our strength. We are the sons of Caliban. Let fury guide your weapons. Let vengeance be your song. We are the angels of death, and our enemies shall fall. Nice. 
about it, I've, I've listened to the book about the lion, the, the, the saying the sons of Calum makes so much more sense. Brother Librarian, the initial boarding strike is proceeding, but we have lost contact with Squad Gideon. Your sensorium should receive Gideon's beacon signal, though it will be weak. We need Squad Gideon to secure the breaching zone. Locate them as quickly as possible. Right. When you are successful, proceed to secure the landing area to establish the full bridgehead. Praise the Lion. Hey. Deploy. Now, am I going for for the heavy or the carry? Nah, I'm going for for the main one. Let's just go for this. Let's go simple. Librarian, command Barakil to follow you. He will protect your back. So, we start seeking for Gideon Squad. We're sending Gideon's beacon channel to you. Swift vengeance.
Following dire premonitions from the brothers of the right. Librarius, Azrael, Supreme Grand Master of the Dark Angels, me. dispatched just, a strike fleet to a star system identified by uh, our dread so visions. Right. Led by Commander Belial, Grand Master of the Deathwing, yeah, 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 yeah. we arrived to find Start. forces of the Imperial Navy and... A Can I skip? Skip? Can I skip now? Can I skip now? Can I maybe? No? Deploy! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on! I wanna do something! In position! Brother Librarian, command Barakil to follow you. He will protect your back. Well, let's just do it first hand now. Oh, we can't reach it. There. Now we're close enough. Scan. Destroy it. I'm not taking any chances being shot again. Start seeking for Gideon Squad. We're sending Gideon's beacon channel to you. Yeah. Swift vengeance.
zijn als all alerts. Machine relics detected. Transmitting. Is there any sensor here? The vessel blocked in ancient times. Start is inevitable information that is in good conditioning. We must reach this vessel. Yeah. Okay. Sure. This way. I think. Now I see a lot of chemical here. Pressing power lets me see a prediction of the future. Right, so I'm gonna die? It's bound to happen with me playing with AI. We'll see. We'll just see. We'll see. Yeah, there Brothers. Was Yes, I hear you. Saw one. She's playing with me.
relics of the past. Scepter of power. Something's going to happen. Oh wait. Scan. Oh wait, wait, wait. Oh, I wanted to cancel that. Could have used it to look at stuff. any cost. Our foes approach quickly. We must reactivate local defensive systems to secure the bridgehead. Receiving strange signal echoes.
I have to really use the minimap a lot because it, 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 it shows where sounds are coming from. side now.
finished. You can do yourself. It is done. In position. The activation of the generators has woken a dormant gene stealer swarm. It is time to establish the bridgehead to allow the main force to breach. Hold your assigned battle zone with your command squad.
Hold in time. Hold position. Glory to the Emperor. Glory to the Lion. Yes. Auto save. We can do this. Going to defend. I am in place. In position.
Otherwise, you can set your sense of resistance to fatal hits. Your determination to defend the Imperium makes each... Your enemies can no longer parry you when you're using a melee weapon as your main weapon. Okay. Ultimate rewards. Weapons no longer jam. Oh, that's also better. Hacking time. You cannot suffer critical hits. Oh, that's also pretty neat. Psy resistance. Hacking time reduced. Toast armor. Psychic. We located the ancient Dark Angel's ship in the heart of the Space Hulk. Bravery. After finding out that Squad Gideon had been slain, we fought a horde of Xenos as we conducted investigatory missions to uncover this enigmatic vessel from our dark and distant past. The Deathwing moved to secure entry into the old ship while we overcame the energy and psychic defenses created by the Gene Stealers. Hard fought was the battle, but the bridgehead had been established, and progress to our objectives continued. We are the Emperor's Blade. And yes, we are. Now, I think this is a good time to wrap up the episode. It was a, a, a good start, except that bath death. You know, we're just going to ignore that. Just ignore that. And we're going to continue later on. I see some really great... Um, uh, things uh, for, for Deathwing. I think it is necessary to play it multiplayer because so single player like this makes it kind of dull and AI is not always your best friend in this. I have to multitask a lot while I just want to do, you know, Hulk smash shoot faces. So maybe for next time I'll see if I can rally up some people. If you want to join, let me know. Maybe we can make some Patreon sessions or anything like that. But for now, I want to thank you for watching. If you like, subscribe and follow this series and let me know what you think about it in the comments uh, below. And I hope you had a great time and hope to see you soon. Bye now!